Are you a parent who is concerned about your child's constantly increasing minus number glasses? Then this video will give you an overview about different myopia progression control measures. Hello everybody, I am Dr. Muthumina. I am working as a consultant in the Department of Pediatric Ophthalmology at Narayan Netralia. Myopia or nearsightedness is one of the most common causes of visual impairment in children. About half of the population is estimated to become myopic by 2050. So in myopia, it is a progressive condition which starts in early childhood and can progress till early adulthood. So what happens in myopia? The eyeball is longer than the normal length and the lens is also slightly steeper than normal so that the light rays, instead of getting focused on the retina, gets focused in front of the retina. As your child grows, this just like how the height is increasing, similarly the eyeball length can also increase. And this eyeball elongation happens at a rapid rate if your child is too much into near work, including screen time. So what can we do about it? What are the measures to control myopia progression? Firstly, lifestyle measures. Please limit your child's screen time near work. Reduce total screen time to less than one hour per day. Next important thing about lifestyle measure is encouraging your child to play more outdoors. Outdoor exposure should be at least two hours per day. Playing outdoors under sunlight will also help in reducing eyeball elongation. A sunlight exposure can increase vitamin D absorption and various studies have shown that vitamin D also plays a role in inhibiting myopia progression. If for academic reasons they have to use screen, then at least make sure that they are not spending constantly on the screen, like give frequent breaks. 20-20-20 rule, like once in 20 minutes, take a 20 second break, look at a distance 20 feet away. Ask the child to take frequent breaks and not to look at the screen constantly. Secondly, uh, we have the special drops called low-dose atropin drops. This can be used every day at night time once in both the eyes before going to bed. These drops are low-dose concentration, so they are well tolerated and generally considered to be safe and they have shown promising results among our patients. Next comes orthokeratology. Ortho-K lenses are special type of contact lenses which your child can wear overnight during sleep and the next day they can be free of any glasses or contact lenses. So what this lens do? It modifies the shape of the cornea. It flattens the cornea while in use. Next comes the special glasses which uh, uses DIMS technology or defocus incorporated multiple segments. This will look like your general regular glasses only, but it also acts by inhibiting the eyeball elongation. These special glasses will have a central zone for correcting your distance vision. There will be also peripheral rings of myopic defocus, which sends a signal to the brain to inhibit the eyeball elongation. So yes, myopia, though being a progressive condition, it can be controlled by using this, these measures. So please visit your nearby pediatric ophthalmologist to know what modality will suit your child the best. Thank you.